Hello, ladies and gentlemen, to all the viewers in the YouTube land, we are live in a live stream video. And also, I also wanted to introduce you to, to, to all the viewers, to all my friends. And also, like, the first person that I'm introducing to all the viewers is our host, with the roast, my broski, Chris. And also, we got Elizabeth joining us on last but not least, Anthony Casanu. And for yours truly, Agent Jared, a.k.a. Handsome Devil. And it's so cold here. All right, broski, take it away, broski. Oh, my God. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Lopez. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome, Bruski. Uh, awesome. your, your, your personal system. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh, so, <laughs> sorry about that, guys. Uh, welcome. Welcome, guys, to the live stream and uh, or Zoom meeting or podcast, whatever you call it. And, uh, uh, don't worry. I'll edit that out later. So, so hi, I am, as your host, I am uh, Chris Carrion. Join us some of my... Some of a couple friends, Mr. Jared Lopez, say hello. Well, we already said hi to him already. Hello, everyone. Okay. okay. Um, we've got uh, Anthony Castano, which is our returning guest. Say hi, Anthony. Hello. Hello. Hi. How's everybody doing? Okay. And we've got uh, a newcomer, who, who uh, one of my new a new guests. Her name is Elizabeth Bales. Elizabeth. My girlfriend. Say hi, Elizabeth. Hi. All right. Okay. So, hello, guys, and what? And so, what we're gonna do today? Uh, um, when we left off, we did uh, a series. Uh, there's an ongoing series called Emotions, and um, part two. And um, yes. Yeah, so, if you missed it, just check out the last video, and uh, come back here. So, okay. So. Guys, so why don't you why don't you let's just start by introducing yourselves for for our first time listeners or first time viewers. So uh, we'll start with uh, we we'll start with Anthony. Introduce yourself, Anthony. <clears throat> Anthony, introduce yourself. Please. Oh me? Yeah, you. <laughs> Oh my God, I, I'm sorry, guys. Uh, yeah, so hello, my right, name you. is Anthony Castanofe. Uh, what do I... Okay. Yeah. Okay. By the way, guys, we also have uh, Anna de Jesus here. Uh, yeah. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. All right. Um, we'll come back to him. Um, Elizabeth, would you mind introducing yourself? Yes. My name is Elizabeth Bales. I'm 21 years old. I'm graduating from high school. I love to sing and I love to act. That's it. That's it. Well, that's good. Yeah, yeah, it's good. So we have a creative type. We have another creative type, which is good. I mean, my yeah. girlfriend's here. Okay. Hey. Hey, princess. Thank you. Hey. How are you? Good. Um, good. You know what? This is actually perfect that Anna's here because since we're doing uh, emotions, <clears throat> we could we talk we could talk about uh, you know um some emotions. <clears throat> Guess what, babe? What happened, babe? Guess what? What? I think my brother forgave me. Oh, that's good. Yay. Yeah, he, he was interacting with me today. That's good. Yay. Um, uh, well, I was going to say Jared introduced yourself, but I think we already know a lot about you at this point. All right, so let's see. Uh... Hello, everybody, to all the viewers that are watching on, especially to all on your devices on YouTube. And so my name is Jerry Lopez, and I'm 30 years old. And best of all, I am super strong and a handsome devil, to be honest. Oh and also, so 
is I'm actually I'm actually a Nintendo Switch gamer, and also the games I usually play for the Switch, especially that represents my Facebook page, are Pokemon games, Mario games, and Kirby games. And what I like to do is I usually like to act at the ITP meeting at the Area Stage Company. I mean, at the company like along with Elizabeth, Chris, Anthony, and Anna as well. And also, to be honest with everyone, and uh, because there is a strong passion that I really have, and it's always about acting and becoming the best actor that I could ever be. And best of all, the handsomest. <laughs> and that's all I have to say about myself. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys, uh, for that. Jared drank too many Starbucks coffees. I'm so sorry. Um, uh, so um so let's just uh, let's just jump into it let's just jump into it guys um so so the first emotion we're gonna be talking about we'll continue our series on emotions so the first um emotion we're gonna be talking about is um i think we left out on stress so let's go around the room uh, have you guys ever felt like stressed this week? Like stressed out or like very, very com conflicted about something? COVID 19. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. COVID 19. Very stressful. Oh, of mm. course. Of course. Oh. Yeah. Hold yeah. on, Jared. You got your turn. You got your turn. Hold on. Okay. Oh, okay. So, yeah, Elizabeth. Um, yeah, COVID 19. COVID 19 is stressful. Yeah, yes. it's stressful. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. it is. Um, yeah, it is very stressful, and everybody, everybody's ready. Vaccine. Oh, you got your vaccine? Yes. Yes. I got it. I, oh, I, got it. I actually got my vaccine shot, but it was yeah. during on a Wednesday. Jared, you got your chance. Because you see my vaccine shot, I still have a hold to prove it. Hey, Jared, you got your chance to talk, okay? But my first COVID shot, like it was on a Wednesday that passed. Uh. Uh, All right, cool. Uh, Jared, yeah. you got your chance to talk, okay? Just uh, let everybody finish. Let everybody get a chance to finish talking, okay? I promise. All right, like, I was just explaining it to the viewers. So, the, like, the, the, my first movie show was on the Wednesday. I was just explaining it. Yeah. So, so that's good, Elizabeth. I mean, that's um, good, Elizabeth, that you got your vaccine. Yeah. Um, COVID-19 is really hitting a lot of people, like, both mentally and, uh, and, and yes. emotionally. Yes. And the important thing what is that we stay together as a, as a family, that we stay together, like, we help each other out no matter, and keep on loving one another, because tomorrow's never promised. And Absolutely. even... Absolutely. Yeah. Yep. So, um... So yeah, I mean, just uh, so we're getting through this one day at a time, and just remember that there's always there's always somebody there's always somebody here for you, and um, and it's yeah, but it's almost over. Just you, my friends. Forward. Just keep moving forward. Well, uh, uh, to be honest with you guys and all that, because I'm actually in the same boat with Elizabeth, because the thing about COVID nineteen is that. Uh, Unfortunately, the government specifically tells us that we all can out throw parties and we all got to stay home instead of going out to have fun. And let's be honest with you guys, I just want this pandemic to be over with. That way that I can go out and have fun, like just for the heck of it. Yeah, of course. I'm That's sick my of best staying home all day. Yeah. 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 I'm sick of it. Yeah, yeah same oh. here, bro. Uh, so uh, here's a follow-up question. Have you guys uh, had your vaccine shots yet? I did. I did. You did? Uh, me too. Okay. Yeah, and so did I. Actually, I'm having my second shot, like, on the 20th of, th of this month. So. Yeah, they're going to let me know when I can have my second one. Um, um, yeah, like, because thankfully, because thankfully, my mom, like, she specifically let me know the when is going to be my second COVID shot, and it's going to be on May the 5th on a Wednesday. Like, that's going to be the day where I get my second COVID shot. Like, so the worst part about having a vaccine shot, it literally puts you to sleep. Yeah, it's yeah. like the worst part. Like, they literally I, sleep Jerry, during the day. Elizabeth, I'll ask you something. Um, I had something I had uh, Pfizer. Pfizer. Mm -hmm. Pfizer. 
Did Pfizer. you get which Pfizer? Which vaccine? Which vaccine? Pfizer vaccine. Oh yeah. Um. 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 um, 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 um. Yeah. Oh, yeah, sorry, because you're talking about my second vaccine. Should you talk about my second no. vaccine? No, she, no, she's saying, which vaccine did you get? Did you get Pfizer? Did you get Moderna? Which one did you get? Uh, um, you remember? But, um, I mean, to be honest, no. I just don't think to remember that, but I am guessing the first one, so I think. Pfizer. Okay. Yeah. Pfizer. I got Pfizer. I think mine was Moderna. Yeah, me too. Awesome. You got Moderna. Oh, and 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 like also this. So do you guys want to know what's just the worst part about getting your first COVID shot? Like it literally puts you to sleep during the day. That's like the worst part. Like you literally sleep uh -huh. during the day and you end up feeling knocked out. Like, like you literally feel knocked out because of the COVID shot. Uh -huh. like, that's like the worst. Part. Everybody goes back to new normal. Yeah, I know me too. Yeah. Uh, speaking of, by, by the way, just a, just a heads up, guys. If you guys want to talk, just raise your hand, and I'll be more than happy to pick on you. But you gotta let other people finish their finish their conversations, okay? Awesome. Yeah, sounds good. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay. Hey, you're welcome. So Elizabeth, so how do you feel about the about, the, about getting vaccinated? Like, uh, like, what's your like what do you what do you hope hope uh, so you said you got a uh, Pfizer right Elizabeth? I'll be right back, guys. I'm going to the bathroom. Oh, I got Moderna. Oh, me too. Oh, that's good, Elizabeth. Yeah, I got Moderna too. I'm getting my my second one on the twenty. Oh. Good for you. Okay. Thank you. Uh, oh, uh, Anna, did you get vaccinated too? I did two times. Oh, uh, what did you get? I got the first one and the second one. Oh, which one did you get? Which uh, vaccine did you get? Do you remember? I have no idea, but yeah. Oh, oh, okay. I got Moderna. Moderna. Okay, that's cool. Um, so yeah, guys. Um, all right. So yeah, no. Um, we're gonna get. We're gonna. COVID is very very stressful. Um. Okay. Anthony. So the second motion is um, it's grateful. Have you guys ever felt grateful? Very grateful. Yes. Yes. yes please. Yeah, Elizabeth. Uh, my, friends, mm -hmm. my friends, family, my friends and family. That's good, Elizabeth. Um, anything else you want to share? My house. Okay. Oh, that's good. That, that's good. Yeah. It's always your health is actually really, really important. You also got to take care of your body too, because your body is a temple, and you always got to take care of that. And I exercise every. I exercise. I I exercise every day, Monday Monday through Friday. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Keeping yourself that's active. Awesome, Elizabeth. Um, yeah. uh, 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 so I just wanted to say like good everything, Elizabeth, because that's awesome, Elizabeth, that you exercise on Mondays to Fridays. I'm proud of you. Thank you. Yeah. Hey, you're welcome. Anytime, yes. Elizabeth. Yeah. So uh I don't know why, but I feel like I gotta say this. I feel like I gotta say this. Uh, Anna, are you grateful for something? Grateful? Yeah, grateful. Like thankful for something. Um, I would say I'm. I would say I'm thankful for my life. Oof. I felt that. Um, that's huh? that's good. Um, have you ever experienced um a time when you're like truly, truly grateful from the bottom of your heart? Um, what do you mean? Ooh. Like, have you ever, like, was there been a time where, like, you're, like, really, like, overwhelmed by something, but then, you, is, have you ever counted your oh, blessings? No. <gasps> Don't worry. Elizabeth. What? What happened? 
I said, have you ever, have you ever, have you ever counted your blessings before? Like, have you ever thought about like what you're, what you're thankful for? My family yes. and friends. Yes, I have. That's nice. Okay. Um, that's good. Uh, like what? Like what do you uh, besides besides your your health and stuff? I mean, besides your life, what what else are you grateful for? Just curious. I am grateful for um, my dogs. Good job, Elizabeth. My mom. Oh, uh, that's good. Mm -hmm. It's good. Um, and how about your whole your whole family? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, but that's good, Elizabeth. Thank you so much for sharing, Elizabeth. That, that's good Thank that you you're saying. Well, Felix, Ruski, Felix, Felix. I was getting to you. Awesome. I'm super excited yes. about that. <laughs> I'm okay. excited. Jared, what are you grateful uh, for? I'm back. So let's see, the one I'm grateful is about my handsome good looks and my charm. Oh my God, Jared. And also, right. and also like there's more. Up to me being grateful about my handsome good looks and my charmness. I'm grateful for my whole family and also for everything that they support me from time to time. And I'm yeah. also grateful for having my friends, especially since you know like you know the, and, and I like that because the reason why that I'm always grateful, especially for all my friends, because they're always there for me to make me feel better if I'm ever having if I'm ever having a very, very sad day, or if I'm ever feeling sad, or anything like that, my friends are always there for me to cheer me up no matter what. And that's how I'm extremely grateful for that. My family, my friends, and um, and I think about like my family that supports me and also, and also my friends that always supports me no matter what. Awesome. And those are the two things that I'm always grateful about that. Awesome. So, uh, so the next question, so the next question is, have you ever guys, well, I should say like the, the last, well, this, this is the second last question. Um, have you guys ever felt fearful? Like, have you guys ever felt like scared of something? Can you guys, if so, can you guys name me a time when you guys were scared? Felt scared? Elizabeth, why don't you start? Have you ever felt scared? Nobody? I don't remember. Oh, okay. Wow, uh, okay, that's cool. Uh, okay, okay, my maybe, beautiful That's princess. okay. That's okay if you don't, if you don't remember. I'm tired. So I was, I, I felt scared before, like, I'm scared of what uh, other people, I've been scared of what other people think of me. I've been scared of, like, people's, people's, uh, I've been scared of this whole, um, of dying, which is a very valid, you know, people, I've been scared of like a lot, but I think that's a lot of people though. Um, I've been scared of, uh, you know, of, 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 of different things. I've been, you know, responsibilities. Of oh, me, me, babe. Yeah. Um, dude. Uh, oh. Anthony, have you been scared about something before? I mean, I have been scared of a lot of things. What, what have you been scared of? Uh, I, was, I was scared of losing it all a lot. And I never want to lose the love of my life. What about theater? I mean, I was scared when I lost the fear, you know. And that's boyfriend and Anthony. That's cool. Um, well, and, 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 and I feel so to be honest with you guys, like there is this only one thing that I'm really, really scared of. And I would like to share this to all the viewers, including, including to all my close friends, which are you guys. So like, this one thing that I'm really, really scared of, it's about me being really, really old and me passing away in the future. Because the reason why that I'm really scared about that, because the moment that a person passes away in the future, it's like, because 
And then, like, and I think it's the weirdest feeling that I'm having. It's like once you're automatically gone and you can never come back, it's like if you don't see where you're going. That's like the scariest thing about that. Hmm. Well, yeah, like that's the only thing I'm really scared about is me passing away in the future because because whenever I'm no longer here, it's like if I cannot even tell where I'm going, it's like if I cannot see what I'm doing if I'm not there. So yeah, that's like the scariest thing. Oh, Jared, I think Elizabeth said something. What about God? Oh, I'm sorry. What about God? Did you say something? Oh yeah, um, and I and I was like, I mean, so the goodness is. Is it, uh, but uh, whenever a person passes away in the future and all that, and that means that the person's the spirit is up there with God. Right. Yeah. yeah that's right. You're not alone. Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah, and I, um, and I, and I, like, thank you, Elizabeth, for telling me yeah. that because that makes me feel a lot better already. Alright, guys. Oh, my dad. Yeah. Anna, Anna had a, Anna had a her hand raised. So, Go ahead, Anna. Well, time I was scared was when my friend Nicole got really mad at me, and I was scared because I was scared to lose her. I was, just, I'm scared to lose everybody because I'm afraid to be alone. Because I, I used to be alone before. You don't have to be afraid, babe. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody. I guess everybody feels alone sometimes. But you know, with the uh, like, just know that like, uh, when not when you feel that empty loneliness, just remember that that doesn't have to define who you are. Because because you're you're made in God's image, and just know that you you have so much you 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 have so much potential. You have like a lot of, you, you've left a legacy of, you impact so many things to a lot of people and you don't have, you don't have, need to be, you're worth more than any relationship, than any job, than any, any, fam, any, any member of a family, man. you're worth more than your insecurities. And you don't need anybody to, to remind you of who you are because you know who you are. I have to believe in myself. Exactly. Thank you, Elizabeth. Yeah. I mean, to be honest with you guys, I'm in the same boat for Elizabeth because I always believe in myself and anything that I normally do, because as long as I believe in myself, especially if I put my mind to it, I can literally achieve anything that comes in my way. No matter how hard it is, no matter how difficult it is, I have to make sure that I accomplish it. Yeah, exactly. And remember, yeah. it's also it's also important to that uh, you gotta love yourself before you can love other people, because nobody yeah, else can true. do that for you. And like, and then just always remember that God loves you just the way you are, no matter what, no matter what disability, no matter what uh, no matter what race, no matter what orientation, nothing. God loves you just the way you are, and um, just know that. In the in the midst of the storm, just know that there's always hope. In the light of every time. Yep. So yeah. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Oh yeah, we still got time for one more question. Um so Oh my goodness, I almost forgot about the commercial break. The, um, and I like the commercial break sponsorship, remember? We'll do that. Yeah, we'll do that right after this last question. Thank you, Mr. Lopez. Thank you, Mr. Lopez. Thank goodness I remind you. That, like that's why. But that's why the, I'm your personal assistant because I reminded you about uh, that. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the last, so the last question before we go on commercial break is, um, have you, have you guys ever like felt betrayed by anyone? Mm -hmm. like, have, you, have you guys ever felt like anxious, like very anxious? Oh, anxious. I'm oh, gonna, yeah. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm Elizabeth. Yeah. Go first, and then Anna, and then Anthony, and then Jerry. So I'm sure. anxious sometimes before I sing. You get anxious before you sing? Sometimes. Okay. So what do you do to do? What do you do to to make yourself not 
know, to prepare breathing, mm -hmm. breath exercises, breathing exercises, and breathe deeply. Exhale. Chris? Yeah, that's good. I mean, that's always important to, to do, like, uh, like, you know, meditate, meditate on yourself, you know, with meditations. Yeah. Sometimes prayer, prayer is also a good thing to it's really it's, it's really, you know you gotta get your mind right before you can get well you gotta get your heart right before you can get your mind right. But sometimes the heart can be deceiving. But it's fine. Um let's see, Anna. Oh oh by the way, good job, Elizabeth. That's a solid answer. Thank you so much for sharing. Anna, have you ever felt anxious? Yes. Okay. And when has been, when has been the time that you were anxious? Um, like I don't know if I should say, but it's, okay. it's a safe space. So fine. Uh, when I send that. Okay. Also, single. I was with my ex boyfriend, and well, there's been some problem, and I was a I, I was afraid he would break up with me. I was anxious. Yeah, I was anxious. Okay. Oh, and uh, and how did how did that uh, did you ever tell this person? Not really. But I didn't, like, I was afraid to be a bad girlfriend. Oh, like, you're, okay, so you're afraid to be rejected by the other person? Yeah. Oh, oh wow, yeah. I mean, so basically, you're, you, you don't like, you hate the fear of rejection because you, because you fear of the opinions of others. I don't know, but it does make me anxious too. Oh, okay. All right, that's valid, yeah. Um, Anthony, have you ever felt anxious about something? Is that? Oh, yes. Yes, I have. Okay. Um, um, have you, do you know a time when you felt very, very anxious to the feeling of overwhelm? Well, the time when... I was still with my ex-girlfriend and she, she's she been a pain in my ass for the rest of my life. Oh, my God. Because, uh, and I could... Uh, language, sorry. Oh, sorry. I mean, <laughs> she's been okay. a pain in my rear end all day. And that bothered me. Oh, that's... Oh, okay. And why, were, why was she a pain? What happened? What made her be a pain? Oh, well, you know... You know, she acts like a little child and it got a little annoying for me and I, and I got a little, because she's low f functioning. Oh. And she's too- Is it Nami? <sighs> yes. Okay. Babe, I don't mention your ex's name. I know, um, but if I could come up with, I know, but that's all. All right, so uh, that's cool. Uh, thank you for sharing, guys. Uh, yeah. Let me go first, and then I'll dare to be last. Um, yeah, yeah then, save the best for last for yours truly. Okay, uh, Jared, just come to chill. Okay, take a chip pill. Okay. Yeah, I know, I know. Uh, I know the, I mean, I'm just representing the handsome devil thing like this. Okay. okay so it's all, I've, the, all, the, it's all, the, it's all the viewers in the YouTube land. Okay. Okay. So I, I've been very anxious about. Um, Losing my losing uh, losing my job, losing my friends, all because of my atti the attitude that I have towards others, and um, they've been having a very negative attitude towards people, even though I don't mean to. And um, but I'm working on it. Jerry knows I'm working on it. And Jerry knows I'm working on it. And um, Oh, I need to lay down. And uh, and to be honest, like I've uh, I, I don't like losing people. It makes me feel like I'm doing something wrong. Um, 
So, yeah. And uh, and anxious, yeah, I've been anxious. Like, I feel like when I'm at work, I feel like if I mess something up, I feel like I'm, if I one little mistake and I feel like I'm doing my job wrong, my whole job wrong. Like, I feel like, uh, oh, like, what if, what if they, what, what would they say about me? Or like, oh, like, what if, what if I'm doing, what if I'm not doing a good job? Or if I'm not doing what I'm supposed to be doing? All these different things. But you know, I just try to, you know, just take a, like Elizabeth said, take a deep breath. Just try to relax. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Are you okay, babe? Yeah, I just, I got a big headache right now. You do? Mm-hmm. What's wrong, man? Okay, I hope you feel better, babe. Yeah, you can, 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 I, can I get some rest? Yeah, yeah, sure, Anthony. Yeah, of course. All right. Mm-hmm. Talk What's to you really? guys later. Uh, yeah, for sure, man. All right. Love you, babe. Love you. Bye. Bye, my love. So, yeah, guys. Um... <clears throat> All right, all right. So yeah, guys. So Jared, uh, I guess you're last. Have you Save ever the best for last, folks. Jared, okay. If you say that one more time, I swear. Oh. <laughs> I swear. What? Jared, what? You, you know darn well what. Well, I'm just doing my head some devilish looks. Oh my god. <laughs> No one, no wonder this guy wants to be friends with me. Um, hey, hey, that's not true. I'm just kidding. 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 We're just taking a nice and slow, bro. I'm just kidding. Yeah, I know. I know you were kidding. I know you were kidding. Have you ever felt like anxious? Tell a story when you were anxious. Well, then after that, we'll do some questions. I think I know the perfect example about me being anxious. Keep so let's see if I'm super... Yes, I'm on it, Broski. I'm on it. So let's see. I'm assuming the last time that I was being very anxious was about was about this one person that literally specifically said to everyone to block me on Facebook and not to talk to me anymore. And that one person, to be honest, is Sessie. Uh-oh. And also the way that she specifically said to everyone, like, Anthony, guys, make sure Anthony, that you block Jared and make Anthony, sure that you block Jared. Oh, God. Jared, let's not, let's, Jared, Jared. If let's, I hear you talking about Suski again, I'm going to leave yeah, the chat. Yeah, let's not, let's not, uh, let, you know what, let's come to the That's what she did. Like, she Jared, literally Jared, said to Jared, everybody Jared, about Jared, that. Jared, okay, let's start, let's go to commercial. Let's go to commercial. We'll all feel better after the commercial. Oh my god. Yeah, like, I'm, I'm just saying it like it is. Like, that's what Jared, she did. Jared, Jared, just... Let's cut to commercial. Okay. So, so this, com- so this uh, commercial break is, so this Zoom meeting is brought to you by, is brought to you by, um, a Skechers Shoes. Because why not? <laughs> Skechers Shoes fits everybody. <laughs> So well, uh, make sure you get sketch your shoes. Good try, Pookie. So yeah. Mm-hmm. And uh, we also got another sponsor. If Anna wants to leave the group chat, you got it. Back well, to the show. Oh my god. Oh you got my it. god. Okay. Yes, she and, uh, okay, okay, guys. Uh so that's that's it. Um, so, guys, I'm afraid we're going to have to cut this short. I'm afraid we're going to have to cut this short, guys. So, um, thank you. If you, if you like what you see, if you like, guys like what you heard, or so, just subscribe and, and just, uh, just subscribe, like, share, all that. So, thank you, guys, for watching. And uh, stay inspired, guys. And we'll see you all next time, guys. Agent Jerry, handsome devil out.
And as always, stay handsome and, and gorgeous. Thank you again. Thank you guys for for joining joining us, Elizabeth. Thank you so much. Yes. Thank you so much. And uh, yeah, have a good night, Elizabeth. Have a good night, guys. Night. Night. Bye. Have a great night, Elizabeth. Have a great Bye. night, Rosie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <sighs>